The Jewel of India is prepared to compete to wear the Jewel of Fit India quiz. This is the state of visionary and brave leaders like Rani Gaidin Liu and Pauna Brajavashi who didn't bow down in front of the British regime. This is the land of the boxing legend Maricom. Weightlifters like Ann Kunjarani Devi, Mirabai Chanu, Kumukcham Sanjita Chanu, hockey players like Tingon Liyama Chanu and footballers like Jackson Singh Thaunajam and Gibson Singh Moirangtham. This is the land of indigenous sports and culture. Saying so, we welcome you to the Fit India Quiz Manipur edition presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports and Ministry of Education with Fit India Mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav is an initiative of the Government of India to celebrate and commemorate 75 years of progress of India and the glorious history of its people, culture and achievements. Fit India Quiz is the biggest Indian quiz on sports and fitness like none other. The Fit India Quiz provides an opportunity to students and schools to win cash prizes of rupees 3.25 crore and be the champion at state and national level. In the preliminary round, 36,299 students from 13,502 schools participated in the mobile-based test conducted by the National Testing Agency. Participation was from more than 626 districts across India. After the preliminary rounds, 360 schools will be participating in the state web rounds where they'll be competing with the selected schools from their respective state or union territories to become state or union territory champions and represent their state or union territory in the national finals. So without any further delay, let's go to our virtual auditorium to meet our quiz master for today. A very warm welcome to the Fit India Quiz semi-finals, the Manipur edition. I am Nikhil Biswas, your quiz master for the day. Without any more delay, let's go and meet our semi-finalists for today. Please remember that the top two scorers of this round will represent their school and state at the state grand finale. So semi-finalists team one, if you can introduce yourselves. Good afternoon everyone. I'm, I'm Neri Chantan and my teammate is Hanya and we represent Team Ipatons Nagas High Secondary School. Very warm welcome team one. And who is your favorite sports personality? My name is Mary Com and my name is Lionel Messi. Wonderful, Mary Com, Lionel Messi. We move to team two. Team two, introduce yourselves. Hello, I'm Aditya of the uh, one where we are together. My partner is Luis Kapan. Very warm welcome, team two. I would like you to be a little louder, Team 2. And who is your favorite sports personality? Little louder? Sunil Chetri. Sunil Chetri fans, well done. We move to Team 3. Team 3, please introduce yourselves. My name is Muranjim Abinson Singh and I'm representing the world now with David Dalla, Yarapani Palace. And my name is Ifa Marima. And I'm from class 9. Very warm welcome team 3. And who is your favourite sports personality? Mine is Deepika Kumari. Mine is Milka Singh. Wonderful. Deepika Kumari, Milka Singh. Wonderful, wonderful. We move to the last team, team 4. And uh, one of your partners is missing because she is unwell. Uh, so brave of you. Team 4 to be participating and representing your school. Wonderful. Thank you, Please sir. introduce yourself. Sir, my name is Saiko Minuan. We're from St. George High School. And uh, what game do you like to play? Badminton. Badminton. Saying so, we will now introduce our expert for the day. Our expert for the day is Miss Rashmita Guha, Captain Fit. Welcome, ma'am. <laughs> Thank you so much for having me on board, sir. And uh, uh, it's absolutely an honor to be a part of something which is so huge and great. Uh, moving on, I'll just uh, cut the chase and I would only like to uh, wish all the contestants all the very best. Do great, play, play real well and healthy and 
I really hope and pray you won't be needing my help. But in case you do, uh, I'm right here to help. Thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you so much. Thank you, and sir. And teams, aren't we excited to be in this semi-finals? But before we move on to the first round, I would like to tell all the participants that besides Captain Fit, you have two more helplines. One being head or tail, which will make two incorrect options disappear. And toss the cue, which you can use to completely change your question. So teams, if you're ready, here's your first round, which is called Fitness Ki Dos Aadha Ghanta Rose. Let's take a look at the rules. Fitness Ki Dos Questions on Yoga, Fitness and Nutrition Clockwise Round Direct question to each team. The question will not pass. Correct answer will fetch 10 points. And if lifeline is used, correct answer will fetch 5 points. No negative marking. Lifelines are available. Quizmaster's decision is final. Round 1 Fitness Kiddos Team 1, if you're ready, here's your question on your screen. The percentage of fat, bone and muscle in the body is called A. Body Composition B. Metabolic Rate C. Muscular Strength or D. Muscle Composition And your time starts now. If you're in doubt, you can always use your lifelines. Quickly, team one. The, um, the answer is option number A. You say the answer is option number A, body composition. Let's take a look if that's the fit answer. And that is absolutely a fit answer. <laughs> Clap for yourself and smile. Moving to question number two. Team two, if you're ready, this is your question. Sunshine vitamin is another name for dash. A. Vitamin K. B. Vitamin C. C. Vitamin D. Or option D. Vitamin B. And your time starts now. So C. Vitamin D. You say C. Vitamin D. Let's take a look if that's a fit answer. That is absolutely a fit answer. Well done. Moving on to the third question. Identify this exercise that makes the pectoral muscles stronger. A. Fly machine. B. Inchworm. C. Fire pit. Or D. Bear crawl. And your time starts now, Team 3. Team 3, if you're in doubt, you can always use your lifelines. Option A. Fly machine. You say option A, fly machine. Let's take a look if that's a fit answer. That is absolutely a fit answer. <laughs> also serious, why? You're answering, you should be smiling and enjoying the Fit India quiz. We move to the last question in the Fitness Kidos round. Team 4, this one is for you. Identify this exercise which works on the gluteal muscles. A. Bridge, B. Crisscross, C. Windmill or D. Russian Twist. And your time starts now. Option A. You say Option A. Bridge. Let's take a look if that's a fit answer. That is absolutely a fit answer. <laughs> With that, we come to the end of the first round which is called Fitness Kidos Adha Ghanta Rose. But before we take a look at the scores, a short break. Fit India quiz में देश के कोने कोने से भाग लेने वाले सभी विद्यार्थियों का मैं अभिनंदन करता हूं और आशा करता हूं कि आप सभी जी जान लगाएंगे, जीतने के लिए खेलेंगे, Fit India quiz में भाग लेंगे और अपने विद्यालय परिजनों एवं राज्य का नाम रोशन करेंगे। आपको ढेरों शुभकामनाएं, जय हिंद, जय भारत। We are back after the break to the semi-final of Fit India Quiz, Manipur edition, presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports, 
मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ एजुकेशन विथ फिट इंडिया मिशन इन सेलिब्रेशन ऑफ आजादी का अमृत महोत्सव फिट इंडिया क्विज इज द बिगेस्ट इंडियन क्विज ऑन स्पोर्ट्स एंड फिटनेस एंड एज आर ऑनरेबल मिनिस्टर ऑफ यूथ अफेयर्स एंड स्पोर्ट्स श्री अनुराग सिंह ठाकुर जी राइटली मोटिवेटेड द यूथ ऑफ इंडिया टू पार्टिसिपेट इन दिस फिटनेस मिशन विद द वर्ड्स है दम तो बढ़ाओ कदम नाउ लेट्स टेक अ लुक एट दिस कोर्स All four teams are on 10 points. Clap for yourselves. This is going to be a cracker of a quiz. We move to round 2, which is called Champion of Champions. Let's take a look at the rules. Champions of Champions. Questions on Indian sports personalities. Each clue on the buzzer. There will be three clues to guess the answer. Each clue will fetch 15 10 and 5 points respectively The question will not pass wrong answer will fetch minus 5 points No additional lifelines for this round Quiz master's decision is final Champion of champions round a buzz around always very very exciting but remember teams if you're not sure with the 15 pointer wait for the 10 pointer if you're not sure with the 10 pointer wait for the five pointer which is a picture clue right so fingers on your buzzers first question in the champion of champions round for 15 points here's your clue this woman footballer from manipur was awarded the aiff women's player of the year in 2015 anyone going for it no one trying The buzzer is open. Anyone can go for it. No one trying. We move to the ten pointer. In January 2020, she was signed for Scottish Women's Premier League club Rangers. No one trying. We move to the picture clue. And team three is gone for the buzzer. Yes, team three. Team three, I want an answer immediately. Yes, team three. If you don't answer in the next few seconds, I'm going to give you a minus five. Nangom Baladevi. Sorry. Nangom Baladevi. Let's take a look if there. That's a fit answer. It's Bala Devi. We move to the next question. She holds the Commonwealth Games record of 84 kg for the 53 kg snatch category. Anyone going for it? No one trying. We move to the 10 pointer. She won the gold medals at the 2014 Glasgow and the 2018 Gold Coast events in the women's 48 kg and 53 kg weight category respectively. Still no one trying. Let's take a look at the picture clue. And team 3 is gone for it. Yes team 3. Sanjita Please be clear Sanjita I want that once more Sanjita Are you saying Sanjita Yes sir Okay you saying Sanjita let's take a look if that's the answer that is absolutely a fit answer five points to you Moving on to the third question in the champion of champions round for 15 points fingers on your buzzers here's your clue she was part of the historic 1993 indo nepalese women's everest expedition no one trying all playing safe we move to the 10 pointer next clue She was awarded the National Adventure Award in 1994 and Padma Shri in 2004.
still no takers let's take a look at her picture you're all thinking hard but no one's pressing the buzzer so we will take a look at the answer and it is gurmayum anita devi we move to the last question in the champion of champions round buzzers reset fingers on your buzzers teams for 15 points here's your clue hailing from manipur and a 2017 arjuna awardee she is nicknamed the durga of indian football anyone going for it no one trying we move to the next clue she was the captain of the indian team that emerged winners at the 2010 south asian games and 2012 saff women's championship still no one trying let's take a look at her picture no one's going for it let's take a look at the answer and it is oinam bembem devi with that we come to the end of the champion of champions round but before we take a look at the scores a short break fit rehna utna mushkil kaam nahi hai jitna kuch logon ko lagta hai फिटनेस की डोज आधा घंटा रोज इस मंत्र में सभी का स्वास्थ्य सभी का सुख छिपा हुआ है की डोज आधा घंटा रोज वी आर बैक आफ्टर द ब्रेक टू द सेमीफाइनल ऑफ फिट इंडिया क्विज मणिपुर एडिशन प्रेजेंटेड बाय मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ यूथ अफेयर्स एंड स्पोर्ट्स मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ एजुकेशन विथ फिट इंडिया मिशन इन सेलिब्रेशन ऑफ आजादी का अमृत महोत्सव एंड आर ऑनरेबल प्राइम मिनिस्टर could not have said it in a better way of how important fitness is in our lives fitness ki dose aadha ghanta roz let's take a look at the scores nothing has changed all four teams are still on 10 points clap for yourself we move to the third round which is called bharat ke khel Let's take a look at the rules. Bharat ke khel. Questions on traditional Indian sports. Anti-clockwise round. Direct questions to each team. No passing. Correct answer will fetch 10 points and if lifeline is used, correct answer will fetch 5 points. No negative marking. Lifelines are available. Quiz master's decision is final. Bharat ke khel round. Anti-clockwise round. Team 4 this is your question on the screen What sort of sport is sagol kangje is it a horse polo b boat game c boat race or d kite flying competition and your time starts now Option A <coughs> You say option A Let's take a look if that's a fit answer That is absolutely a fit answer. Well done. <laughs> Team 3, if you're ready, this is your question. Identify the traditional boat race ceremony held as a part of the religious festival of Lai Haroba. Is it A Slambam, B Yubilapki, C Hyang Tanaba or D Mukhna? 
You have First. your options. Your clock has started. Si Hyang Tanaba. You say Si Hyang Tanaba. Let's take a look if that's a fit answer. That is absolutely a fit answer. Ten points to you. <laughs> Moving on to team two. Team two, this is your direct. Arambai Hunba is an ancient martial art form which is practiced on horseback by Manipuri warriors. Arambai refers to a sword, b sharp pointed flying weapon, c bamboo stick or d wooden baton. And your time starts now. If you're not sure, you can always use your lifelines. Uh, option B. You say option B. Let's take a look if that's a fit answer. And that is absolutely a fit answer. Well done, team two. The last question in this Bharat K Khel round, team one, this is for you. Identify this popular Indo Manipuri game. Is it Kyang Tanaba, B Kong Kangjai, C Arambai Hunba, or D Kang Sanaba? And your time starts now. <laughs> It's option D, Kang Sanaba. You say it's option D. Let's take a look if that's a fit answer. That is absolutely a fit answer. <laughs> With that, we come to the end of the Bharat K Khel round. And before we take a look at the scores, let's take a short break. Fit India quiz में देश के कोने कोने से भाग लेने वाले सभी विद्यार्थियों का मैं अभिनंदन करता हूँ और आशा करता हूँ कि आप सभी जी जान लगाएंगे जीतने के लिए खेलेंगे फिट इंडिया क्विज में भाग लेंगे और अपने विद्यालय परिजनों एवं राज्य का नाम रोशन करेंगे आपको ढेरों शुभकामनाएं जय हिंद जय भारत वी आर बैक आफ्टर द ब्रेक टू द सेमीफाइनल ऑफ फिट इंडिया क्विज मणिपुर एडिशन presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports, Ministry of Education with Fit India Mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. Fit India Quiz is the biggest Indian quiz on sports and fitness. Let's take a look now at the scores. Team 1, Team 2 and Team 4 are on 20 points each. Clap for yourselves. And Team 3 leaders of the stage with 30 points. We move to the last round in the semi-final and it's called Freestyle. Let's take a look at the rules. Freestyle. Sports mixed bad questions. 12 questions on the buzzer. Correct answer will fetch each team 10 points. Minus 5 for wrong answer after buzzer. No additional lifelines for this round. Quiz master's decision is final. Freestyle, buzz around, everything goes topsy turvy in a buzz around. So, teams, fingers on your buzzers. Here's your first question on screen How many laps do athletes have to complete in a 10,000 meter race on a standard outdoor athletics track? How many laps are we talking about? No one trying, no one wants a minus five. All playing safe. Let's take a look at the answer. It's 25 laps. You see, this is a Fit India quiz. And in a Fit India quiz, you learn so much. Fingers on your buzzers. We move to question number two. In which Indian city did Sanya Mirza win her first WTA tour title in singles? Was it? Hyderabad or Delhi? Anyone trying? No one going for the buzzer? Let's take a look at the fit answer. It's Hyderabad. And now they're saying, I told you it's Hyderabad. You never listened to me. Okay, we move on to the next question. With which sports is hit wicket associated? 
Hit wicket is associated with which sport? Still no one trying? Let's take a look at the fit answer. It's cricket. And now they're laughing. We move to the next question. In which year did India become the first Asian country to reach the semi-finals of the Olympic football tournament? 1956 or 1960? And team two has gone for the buzzer. Team two. You say 1956. What did you say, 1956? Yes, sir. 1956. Okay, let's take a look if that's a fit answer. That is absolutely a fit answer. So happy. Moving on, fingers on your buzzers, buzzers reset. Here's your question. Which trophy is named after Kumar Sri Ranjit Singh Ji? All teams playing safe. Nobody going for it. So let's take a look at the answer. It is the Ranji Trophy. It is the Ranji Trophy teams. We move to the sixth question. Six more after this. The 1982 Asian Games were held chiefly in New Delhi. But some of the events were also held in which two other cities? Anyone trying? No one trying, no one going for the buzzer. So we take a look at the fit answer. It is Bombay and Jaipur. Moving on to question number seven. Which campaign was launched by Fit India on Gandhiji's 150th birth anniversary as a part of Swachh Bharat Abhiyan? None of the teams trying. Let's take a look at the fit answer. It is the Fit India Plog Run. Fit India Plog Run. Moving on to question number eight. In Coco, a player who pursues the players of the opposite side or runners to tag and touch them is called Dash. Fill in the blank. Sure, you must have played Coco in school. Anyone going for it? Team two's gone for it. Yes, team two. Chaser. You say chaser. Let's take a look. It's an active chaser. Chaser. I'll give you points. I'll give you the points. Ten points to you. We move on to the ninth question. In a game of volleyball, a dash is registered when a player has scored a point or a side out by successfully attacking or hitting the ball onto the opposing team's court floor within their court lines and boundaries. Fill in the blank. Anyone trying? No one going for the buzzer. Let's take a look at the fit answer. It's called a kill. So as I said, in a Fit India quiz, you learn so much. Moving on to the 10th question. Identify this sport, watercraft. Team 1's gone for the buzzer. Yes, Team 1. Rowing. You say rowing. Let's take a look if that's a fit answer. It's Keno. I'm sorry, team one. Moving on to the 11th question on your screens. How long was the Fit India Walkathon organized by ITBP in Jaisalmer? No one trying. Let's take a look at the fit answer. 
It's 200 kilometers. Coming to the last question in the semi-finals. The word athlete is an ancient Greek word that means one who competes for a prize. True or false? Team 4 has gone for it. Yes, Team 4. False. Once more, please. False. You say it's false. Let's take a look. It's true. Team 4, it's true. With that, we come to the end of the freestyle round. But before we take a look at the scores, a short break. Life may challenges kabhi bhi aur kahi bhi aa sakte hain. और हम इनका अच्छे से तभी सामना कर सकते हैं जब हम तैयार हों इनको फेस करने के लिए हम अगर हेल्दी और फिट हैं तो हमारी तैयारी और भी बेहतर हो जाती है बस जरूरत है थोड़ी सी मेहनत थोड़े से अनुशासन की प्रेजेंटिंग फिट इंडिया मोबाइल ऐप आपका फिटनेस गाइड और पर्सनल हेल्थ ट्रेनर पहली बार अब भारत का हर एक नागरिक अपना फिटनेस कोर पता करके जान पाएगा की वो कितना फिट है आप अपनी आयु के अनुसार अपने फिटनेस स्कोर की जांच कर सकते हैं ये सुविधा खास आपके लिए पहली बार शुरू की जा रही है ये ऐप आपके फिटनेस रूटीन को ट्रैक कर सारा डेटा स्टोर करता है ताकि आप अपनी प्रोग्रेस देख सकें और फिट रहने के नए और आसान नुस्खे अपना पाएं। इस ऐप के साथ आप बन सकते हैं खुद के फिटनेस मास्टर उसके बाद हम आपके फिटनेस रूटीन को बनाने में आपकी मदद करेंगे फिटनेस की दुनिया में कदम रखें मोटिवेटेड रहें और अपडेटेड रहें और सबसे अच्छी बात है कि इन सारी सुविधाओं का लाभ आप पा सकते हैं एकदम फ्री बस अपने एंड्रॉइड और एप्पल डिवाइस पर हमारे ऐप का हिंदी और इंग्लिश वर्जन डाउनलोड करें और शुरू हो जाइए आपका फिट रहने का सपना अब है एक क्लिक दूर फिटनेस की डोज आधा घंटा रोज We are back after the break to the semi-final of Fit India Quiz, the Manipur edition, presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports, Ministry of Education with Fit India Mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. Before we go on to take a look at the scores, let me remind you that you too can download the Fit India app from the Play Store or App Store and be fit every minute, every day. And now we move on to that part of the episode which the audience is eagerly waiting for. The Fit India Daily Quiz Question. The process to participate in this quiz is very simple. I will ask one question related to sports and fitness here. All you have to do is to log in to the Fit India mobile app and answer the question in the Fit India Daily Quiz section. The user who gives the correct answer in the fastest time will win a Fit India merchandise. Also, some of the lucky winners will stand a chance to be in the grand finale of the Fit India quiz. Here's your question. In 2008, three men were awarded the Padma Vibhushan together. Two of them were Vishwanathan Anand and Sachin Tendulkar. Name the third one who was awarded posthumously. A. Dhyanchan. B. Edmund Hillary, C. Milka Singh, or D. Balbir Singh Senior. And now, let's take a look at the scoreboard to see which two teams are going to qualify for the state grand finale. Team 1 is on 15 points along with Team 4. And the two teams to qualify for the state grand finale, Team 3 with 30 points and Team 2 with 40 points. Just for yourselves, you smile. With this, we are at the close of the semi-final of Fit India Quiz, the Manipur edition. A big thank you to the Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports and Ministry of Education for giving all of us, especially the children of India, the opportunity to be on such a huge platform like this. And with this, today's Manipur episode is here. मैं निखिल बिस्वास और फिट इंडिया टीम की ओर से आप सबको हार्दिक शुभकामनाएं और ये मैजिकल मंत्र मत भूलिएगा 
फिटनेस की डोज आधा घंटा रोज बाय बाय एंड सी यू वेरी सुन